Hello everyone, today we're going to install Windows Vista on Windows 10. So let's begin. So let's double click on VMware Workstation. Right. So let's create a virtual machine. Right. I'll keep it as typical. Right. Nothing custom. We'll click next. I have the ISO of Windows Vista. So I'm going to click browse. I'm going to put the 32 bit version of it and click open. Then click next. I do have product key of the Windows Vista. So I'm going to paste the product key. All right. The version of the Windows to be installed is going to be Windows Vista Enterprise. The name, I'm going to leave it as ring. I'm going to put the password. It's the login password for the computer. All right. So what I just did is, instead of me adding the product key during the installation of Windows, I put the product key before it, and what it's going to do is inject the product key. Same goes, with, same goes with the password. This is the login password. And this is my um, computer um, computer name. And click next. I'm going to name it as Windows Visa. Keep it by default. I'm going to keep the location by default. You can feel free to change the location, whatever you like. I'll click on next. I'm going to put store virtual virtual disk as a single file. I'm going to keep it as 40. Click next. I'm going to customize just to double check everything. One gig, fine. One processor. And click finish. So right now I'm installing the VMware tools. Unfortunately, the version that the current version of the VMware Workstation 16 Pro has the updated version of the um, VMware tools. I was reading a document as of a few minutes ago that it's not supporting Windows Reset Service Pack 2 or Windows Server 2008 Service Pack 2. So any any older versions of the operating system. Now it does support Windows 7 Service Pack 1. Now what I got a little confused is that it was able to install uh, Windows uh, XP. Which got me thinking a little bit. That's what got me a little confused. So either way. I needed to go and Download the older version of the VMware tools to allow me to install the drivers that it can update and be uh, more feature rich. So I'm going to just click next. This is the complete. Click next and install. I will put this in the description just in case if anyone has trouble installing Vista on the newer platform on VMware Workstation 16 Pro, um, then they can just download the ISO from their site and, um, the, the, excuse me, they can download the VMware tools on their site and then 
have it load up on their on the CD tray. So what I did, I just be and this is just to show you what I did is um under settings, right? I went into the CD DVD under browse, right? I had I downloaded it, and this will load up onto the actual CD drive here in here. I'm going to just do a quick restart. And this is how you install Windows Vista on Windows 10. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Peace.